hello welcome back to the channel once again and today we are going to see the part 2 of AFF and FPFF questions that are being asked in DGXG exam so let's begin so in first part we have covered 30 question and now we will start from the 31st one so question number 31 is why should foam be banged off a bulkhead when extinguishing an oil fire option a to coat the surrounding bulkhead with foam in case the fire spreads b to cool the bulkhead closest to the fire c to prevent any oil on the bulkhead from ignition c to prevent any oil on the bulkhead from igniting d to prevent agitation of the oil and spreading the fire and the correct option is d to prevent agitation of the oil and spreading the fire 32 you are operating a fire hose with an applicator attached if you put the handle of the nozzle in the vertical position, you will Option A. Produce a high velocity fog B. Produce low velocity fog C. Produce a straight stream D. Shut off the water And the correct option is B. Produce low velocity fog 33. A fire hose has a Option A. Male coupling at the both ends b female coupling at the both end c female coupling at the nozzle end and a male coupling at the hydrant end d male coupling at the nozzle end and a female coupling at the hydrant end and the correct option is d male coupling at the nozzle end and a female coupling at the hydrant end 34 which statement is true concerning the use of dry chemical extinguisher option a you should direct the spray at the base of the fire B. You should direct the spray directly into the fire C. You should direct the spray at a vertical bulkhead and allow it to flow over the fire D. All of the above And the correct option is A. You should direct the spray at the base of the fire 35. A fire has broken out on the stern of your vessel You should maneuver your vessel so the wind Option A. Blows the fire back toward the vessel. B. Comes over the bow. C. Comes over the stern. D. Comes over either beam. And the correct option is B. Comes over the bow. 36. Which statement describes the primary process by which fires are extinguished by dry chemical? Option A. The stream of dry chemical powder cools the fire. B. The dry chemical powder attacks the fuel and oxygen chain reaction. C. The powder forms a solid coating over the surface. D. The dry chemical smoothes the fire. And the correct option is B. The dry chemical powder attacks the fuel and oxygen chain reaction. 37. When dry chemical extinguishers are used to put out class B fire, there is a danger of reflash because dry chemical Option A is not an effective agent on class B fire. B does little or no cooling. C dissipates quickly. D is rapidly absorbed by the liquid. And the correct option is B does little or no cooling. 38. Fires of which class would most likely occur in the engine room of a vessel? And the option are A class A and B. Option B, classes B and C. Option C, classes C and D. Option D, classes A and D. And the correct option is option B, classes B and C. 39. When discharging a portable CO2 fire extinguisher, you should not hold the horn of the extinguisher because the horn, option A, becomes extremely hot, B, becomes extremely cold, C, could come off in your hand D is placed directly in the flame and the correct option is B becomes extremely cold question number 40 firefighting foam is only effective when the foam option A penetrates to the bottom of the fire B is kept saturated with low velocity water fog C mixes with burning fuel oil D completely cover the top of burning liquid and the correct option is D. Completely cover the top of the burning liquid. 41. 
द स्प्रेड ऑफ फायर इज प्रिवेंटेड बाई ऑप्शन ए हीटिंग सर्फेस इज एडजस्टेड टू द फायर बी लिविंग कंबस्टेबल इन इंडेंजर्ड एरिया सी सेटिंग ऑफ द ऑक्सीजन सप्लाई डी ऑल ऑफ द एब एंड द करेक्ट ऑप्शन इज सी सेटिंग ऑफ द ऑक्सीजन सप्लाई फोर्टी टू एज कंपेयर टू कार्बन डाइऑक्साइड ड्राई केमिकल हैज विच एडवांटेज ऑप्शन ए क्लीनर बी इफेक्टिव ऑन मेटल फायर सी ग्रेटर रेंज डी मोर कूलिंग इफेक्ट एंड द करेक्ट ऑप्शन इज सी ग्रेटर रेंज फोर्टी थ्री You can determine that CO2 fire extinguisher is fully charged by option A looking at the gauge B checking the name plate data C weighing by hand D weighing on a properly calibrated scale and the correct option is D weighing on a properly calibrated scale 44 the extinguishing agent most effective for combating wood fire is option A water B carbon dioxide C foam D dry chemical and the correct option is a water 45 portable co2 fire extinguisher should not be used to inert a space containing flammable liquid due to the danger of option a the co2 being inhaled by personal b reflux of burning liquid c vapor condensation on the extinguisher d the discharge causing a static spark and the correct option is d the discharge causing a static spark 46 Which substance might be subject to spontaneous combustion? Option A, coal. B, scrap rubber. C, leather. D, all of the above. And the correct option is D, all of the above. Forty-seven. Which extinguishing agent will cool down a heated bulkhead in the least amount of time? Option A, water stream. B, water fog or spray. C, steam. D, dry chemical. And the correct option is. B water fog or spray 48 which portable fire extinguisher should be used on a class C fire on board vessel option A carbon dioxide B water C foam D carbon tetrachloride and the correct option is A carbon dioxide 49 which fire fighting agent is most effective at removing heat option A water spray B foam C carbon dioxide D dry chemical and the correct option is a water spray question number 50 fire extinguisher of size 3 4 and 5 are designated as option a portable b semi portable c fixed d disposable and the correct option is b semi portable 51 the discharge from a carbon dioxide fire extinguisher should be directed option a at the base of the flame b at the center of the flame C to the lee side of the flames D over the top of the flame and the correct option is A at the base of the flame 52 the extinguishing agent most likely to allow reignition of fire is dash option A carbon dioxide B foam C water fog D water stream and the correct option is option A carbon dioxide 53 The main advantage of a steady stream of water on class A fire is that it option A breaks up and cools the fire B protect the fire fighting crew C removes the oxygen D washes the fire away and the correct option is A breaks up and cools the fire 54 a large fire on the deck of a ship can be fought most effectively with option A dry chemical B foam c high velocity fog d water and the correct option is foam and the correct option is b foam 55 the flammable limit of an atmosphere are the 55 the flammable limits of an atmosphere are the option a two temperatures between which an atmosphere will self ignite b upper and lower percentage of vapor concentration in an atmosphere which will burn if an ignition source is present c upper and lower pressure between which an atmosphere will not burn d two temperatures between which an atmosphere will burn if an ignition source is present and the correct option is b upper and lower percentage of vapor concentration 
in an atmosphere which will burn if an ignition source is present 56 foam extinguishes a fire by option a shutting off the air supply b cooling the fuel to below ignition temperature c dispersing the fuel d removing the source of ignition and the correct option is a shutting off the air supply 57 which type of portable fire extinguisher are designed for use on electrical fire option a dry chemical and carbon dioxide b foam and soda acid c carbon dioxide and foam d dry chemical and soda acid and the correct option is a dry chemical and carbon dioxide 58 to safely enter a compartment where CO2 has been released from a fixed extinguisher system, you should Option A. Wear a canister type gas mask B. Test the air with an offset apparatus C. Test the air with a pure air indicator D. Wear a self-containing breathing apparatus And the correct option is Option D. Wear a self-containing breathing apparatus 59. An extinguishing agent which effectively cools, dilutes combustible vapor, remove oxygen and provide a heat and smoke screen is Option A. Carbon Dioxide B. Halon 1301 C. Dry Chemical D. Water Fog And the correct option is D. Water Fog Last question What is the most important consideration when determining how to fight an electrical fire? Option A, whether the fire is in machinery or passenger spaces. B, danger of shock to personal. C, amount of toxic fume created by extinguisher. D, maintaining electrical power. And the correct option is B, danger of shock to the personal. Thank you for watching the video. Please subscribe to the channel for more videos. Thank you.